Here's a quick instructional on manipulating the different parts of the 3D printer. So this is what you see here is the block for mounting the stepper motor, the drive side of the 3D printer universal axis. To show you what the 3D printer looks like, this is it. And when I talk about the drive side, that is this block right here, this one right there. I'm showing that, which is a clam of two of these pieces where the stepper motor mounts upon. So let's look at how this is created. So we start with a motor block sketch. We pad it out, okay? And we add features. So one by one, we add the bolt pattern. Uh, so that's some of the bolt pattern. I'm going to skip down here, down further. You can hide and unhide the parts. So here, bolt, whole side sketch. So basically, we're adding parts one, one upon the other, consecutively adding sketches and then poking them through to make holes. So moving on, so more parts are added. And then this is what it looks like. Add the nut catchers here motor hole so now we've got the motor hole in here magnet holes so let's hide this stuff here magnet hole sketch so these are all the magnet holes and then with the magnet holes this is what it looks like oh interesting this one's not poked out so there's some bug there interesting and then the final product is this so that's that's the final thing um, so if you see all the different sketches that were drawn here well, let's hide the part and look at all the sketches that were used to generate this structure so a bunch of them you can see them in 3d and then when you pad that all out make the solid structure out of it you see this and then let's hide them again and you can see the that's free cat here you can see how uh, you can set transparency within this block so you can manipulate this fully so this way if you want to modify this you can in any way like if you want to scale this up to a larger size you'd have to modify the underlying sketches and here you see what happened with the magnet holes I just added actually just added these couple to the sketch this other one here didn't show up I gotta see what that is about but right now I wanted to add more magnet holes for a stronger connection. I did that. So that's a quick walkthrough of the motor side.